and welcome to my channel. So today's video is testing another viral TikTok makeup product and I'm by myself for this one. I'm not with Morgan this weekend so it's kind of sad but I'm also very excited to do this video and that is the NYX Marshmallow Primer. So I've seen this all around TikTok and I was like why not try it. They have two versions of this primer and it is the original which is the one I have and they also have the one that is actually infused with the honeydew and that's more if you like have drier skin. I have combination oily skin and I didn't want to try the one with the honeydew just because it's getting a little bit warmer outside and my skin starts to change. I become very oily in my t-zone in the warmer temperatures. This is just the original and it has, it's with marshmallow root. You can use it alone or with foundation. So I'm going to use it with foundation today. So here's an up close look of the product. I forgot to mention I'm going to be doing an eight hour wear test on this. So right now it is 9.40. So I'm going to leave this on for eight hours and give you guys updates throughout the day. It's a whipped velvety consistency, pretty much how marshmallow feels. Okay. And it does smell like marshmallows. Oh my God. Oh my God. This smells divine. That is lovely. This goes on lovely as well. Like this feels very smooth. Wow. This does feel quite nice. <gasps> So first thoughts, I think this is beautiful. I love the smell, I love the consistency, and <laughs> my skin feels so smooth. I feel like every pore is smoothed out, but now the real test is how it holds my makeup, especially my foundation and concealer for eight hours. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put on my makeup, and then I'll let you guys know how my makeup applied after using this. Hey guys, so I just finished applying my makeup. I just filmed the tutorial, so if you guys are interested, I'll leave it in the description below. Everything went on smoothly. Everything went on so smoothly. There was no patchiness, nothing like that. This primer really has impressed me and it's only been an hour. It's only been an hour and yet this has impressed me. Um, gotta give it time to get settled in, give it a few hours. Everything went on so smoothly. No products had any issues, no foundation, concealer, and also my powders went on pretty nicely as well. And also, I forgot to tell you guys the time. So it is 10.56. I know that my background is still Christmas. I don't care, I love it. Catch up with you guys. Maybe at about 12, 30, 1 o'clock. It'll be about three hours since I initially applied the primer. I'll see you guys in a little bit. So it is 12, 30. And I've had this primer on for three hours now. So far, it's holding up pretty well. I'm not feeling any oily or anything like that. I'm gonna just zoom in just to show you guys. Anyway, please excuse like this. I was just eating. Definitely don't see any oil. No dry patches, nothing like that. Yeah, it looks really, really good. My skin looks really good. Doesn't feel bad. It doesn't feel oily, greasy, nothing. You could also tell that even the foundation, the concealer, and the powders went on. Like, it doesn't look bad. Got some rubbing off on, like, my nose because my nose was running a little bit. Nothing on the jawline. So far, I'm loving this primer. It looks and feels really good. Anyway, I'm going to come back in a couple of hours, give you another update. Like I said, I'm going to keep doing this update until 6 o'clock. So, we got a lot of time left. So it's my second to last update. It's just gone past three o'clock and I am very impressed with this primer. Wow, because normally around this time, I noticed that my oils will start coming through and this has not budged at all. I got this right here because I was eating. So this is from when I was eating, so ignore that. Nothing's breaking down right now. Like a little bit of breakdown around my nose, but that's just because my nose was running earlier. Again, and I had to wipe it off. Yeah, nothing is really wrong. My makeup still looks really good with this primer. If it's looking good right now, I can't wait to see what it looks like by the 6 p.m. mark, and that would be eight hours. I am super excited. I'm very excited to see the end results after eight hours because it's been on five hours. It's looking really good. Okay, guys, so it's my final update of the night. So it's 6.02 p.m., and this is my final update for the night so I will say this I love this primer this primer is genius this is better than the professional from benefit and this kind of gives me that similar vibe I want to say this is a dupe for it I think it's a dupe on the way it performs it's not really the texture and the scent but definitely how it performs I definitely give this a solid 10 out of 10. My oils are still pretty good. I mean, there's a couple like coming in from my nose, which is normal, but overall for an eight hour wear day, for an eight hour day, this is bomb. I think you can get up to 12 hours using this thing. Would I purchase this again? 
Absolutely. Will this become my everyday primer? Depending on the season, you know? Like I said, I'm combination skin. So I have larger pores in my T-zone and then when I'm on my cheeks, it's very small. So I would definitely use this for spring, summer. Um, For winter, I would go in more with my Essence Wake Me Up. Is that what it's called? My Essence Primer that I always use. But this, I would definitely use every single time I wear makeup in the summer. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We're trying to hit 1K by May 1st. That's the goal for this channel. I'm just gonna need a little bit of help, just like that little bit, like right, right there. I hope you guys decide to join this group. It's a fun little group, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.